Welcome to Daytime. I'm Glenn Dixon. Hi, I'm Val Court. Today's show, we have a great show coming up. We've got the nominee for an Independent Soap Award, Out With Dad. Really cool show. Really cool show. It's a webisode, like they're, they're doing webisodes. They finished their first series and now they're moving into their second series. And it's about a lesbian girl coming out to her dad. So we're going to hear all about that. That's got to be such a traumatic experience. How do I how do I tell my parents? I've finally figured this out about myself. Now how do I tell people? We have a great show. Come right back. Welcome back. I'm very excited today. I've got Out With Dad series creator Jason Lever, Lever sorry, and actor Kate Conway. Nice to see you. Nice and to see you too. Yes. Very good Welcome to meet you. To Thank you. So Out With Dad. So what prompted you uh, to create this? Um, I had a dream, actually, and I was sitting on the subway uh, going to a shoot, before Rogers, no less, oh, okay. and uh, I just was thinking about this, you know, what would it be like to have uh, a teenager come out to me, even though I'm not a father, so I don't know where it all kind of came from, <laughs> and uh, so that's, that's I, you know, that's what came to me, and I thought that would make for a cute web series, so that's, um, that was the beginning, that was in April of '09. Amazing. Like, I, I'm a, a gay male, and I, and I, I well, male, obviously. <laughs> uh, but I, I always thought about what it must be, feel like for my parents, right? What was that like? And so you're exploring this through your series. In fact, you're, you're actually a supporter, and, and you play a lesbian. Yes. Right. Yes. Um, so, and you're exploring that through your web series. Now, how long, how many, um, how long has the show been on? Well, we premiered in, was it June or July of last year? I thought it was May. No, I don't know. Maybe. Because <laughs> it's been a crazy year for us, right? Yeah. So, yeah, yeah. And, and we premiered it, you know, last year at, at the beginning of the summer. And, uh, and then we put up a new episode on, online about every other month, every other week, pardon me, for, um, and it was eight episodes altogether. So, um, you know, it ended and the last one went up in October. We had a big party then, of course. Amazing, amazing. And so, so you you play a lesbian. Yes. Coming out to your father. Yes. Um, so what? So I want to know both perspectives. So first of all, uh, Jason, what was your perspective? Like, what made you? Well, I mean, I I guess for for me it was like, you know, even though I'm, I'm not a father and I'm not gay, but I just was thinking about these things. Like, what would it be like if? Right. right? And um, so I just started writing, and I started writing it. From I, I, the idea was I wanted to spend like about fifty percent of the story time with Rose, who Kate right. plays, and uh, about fifty percent of the time with the dad, who Will Conlon plays, and just sort of looking at it from both their perspectives: the coming out perspective, the "is my daughter going to come out to me?" thing, uh, because he suspects, although uh, you know he's she's not out yet, kind of thing, right? And uh, so I don't know, like I I don't know what it's it just sounds like you know it's just a, a story full of you know. Tough times, trying to conflicted feelings. Right, you know? right. And and for you, mm -hmm. um, I don't know if you're a lesbian or not, but uh, I'm I'm not. Okay, so playing a lesbian, coming mm -hmm. out to your father, or that process of mm -hmm. coming out, what was that like for you? It was it was interesting. It was definitely um, something I kind of enjoyed exploring. Um, just going back in general to my teen years, because I am a little bit older than the character, um, and kind of dealing with the high school experience. For me, the thought of actually going through that process, it is unbelievably difficult. I've seen a lot of my friends kind of struggle with it. And um, so trying to put myself in that place, even though I've never had to deal with it, I just kind of would go back more towards what it was like for me just struggling with my own identity in general in high school because I was always very self-conscious and, you know, trying to fit in and, and who do I want to be sort of thing. So I kind of tried to use those tools to, to get into the mindset um, as well as just to talk to other friends' experiences with it. So. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a tricky thing because not is. only are you growing up, yeah. but you're also exploring your sexuality, mm -hmm. right? So that's a double whammy. Now the um, so you, you finished the series one, you're going into our season two rather. That's right. Uh, so that's exciting, and you're going to be on Rogers. Like that's you're, right. You're, yeah. So we're premiering here on Rogers TV on uh, March Monday, March fourteenth at eleven p.m., and then it's going to be aired again on the sixteenth and the twentieth again at eleven p.m. So we're very excited to have our TV debut. I know, it's very exciting because right now it's on, on the web. That's right, right? yeah. Um, and getting a, a tremendous amount of hits, like incredible. So you're, like you're at hundreds of thousands of hits. Yeah, we're like, at, like uh, over 600,000 
views now. Incredible. Yeah. Okay. And now where, where would someone go on the web to? Well, I mean, you could just Google Out With Dad. It's the first thing that comes up. Uh, but our website is outwithdad.com. Right. And uh, you know, all the, all the episodes are embedded in there. But we're, we're using YouTube to th show it. It's and it's incredible, incredible. So like the uh, so what's so any big plot twists or turns in the next season? I will answer that with yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, I believe we have a clip of it. This was a really bad idea. It's just you know a romantic comedy, and the fact that it's got two men doesn't matter, and and both their names are William. You said that. Just tell him. This is Dad's messed up way of telling you that he's okay with you. Dad? Yes, Rose? Oh my God, here it comes. Tell her it'll be okay. Tell her she can tell you anything. You can tell me anything. I love you no matter what. Oh my God, this is too messed up. It's like he's reading off a pamphlet or something. Oh my God, you're making this worse. So why are you so into the gay scene lately? <laughs> I just... I'm just, what does the pamphlet say about this, jackass? I just love a good comedy, and Johnny said this was a good one. <laughs> that's great. Now, that's, that scene was, if you just talk about the scene a little bit, so that was when yeah, he's, he's, you're trying to pull <clears throat> out he, from you. Because the dad is suspecting that Rose might be gay, and but he doesn't know how to approach it, and so he's kind of trying to hint, like, I'm okay with it, but he doesn't want to go right out there and say that, so... He brings her to see a romantic comedy, and it's a, a gay romantic <laughs> comedy, and it doesn't really go as well. So their alter egos are like, you know, having conversations with themselves, and and uh, it was a fun shoot that one. Yeah, that was a really fun shoot. I love the the production quality of it too. Thank you. Um, yeah, and and you, you are have also been um, a nominee for the soap the indie. The awards. Okay. Yeah, so we were, we've actually just come back from New York City where we were uh, nominated for five independent soap awards for the, uh, by We Love Soaps, uh, dot com or dot net. Right. And uh, so anyway, we're very proud to say we came back having won the uh, best use, outstanding use of music, which I'm very, very proud of because we have some pretty amazing music in Congratulations. Thank Congratulations. You. I, and I think the show is, is fantastic and, and I'm glad to see that it's hitting the airwaves now, like on television. Congratulations, all your success. Thank you. Um, for more information, please go to outwithdad.com. When we come back, Val will be in the kitchen with Chef G. Washington from Room Service Restaurant. Congratulations. Yeah, great, great. Yeah.